Hey guys, I'm S. Dan Wolf, and welcome back to the channel. And my buddy Claire said it was time for an S. Dan Wolf style hype video, especially now that we're kind of like on our third, I think I believe we're on our third teaser picture for whatever kind of DLC mischief uh, Planet Zoo's got in store for us. If you remember, like on Friday, uh, is March 27th, fr March 27th on Friday, um, they sent out a tweet and it said, it has these two little creeps on there and they're looking like they're at the edge of this jungle and it says on your way to the zoo you come across a strange hiking trail intrigued you follow the trail wondering where it will take you the birds are chirping the air feels warm wait where are you to explore comment left to go left or right to go right so the first thing that beyond drew obviously took from this is uh the birds are chirping so are they kind of hinting at us maybe getting birds in this DLC. Um, I'm thinking that could be a possibility. Um, I was talking to a couple people, though, that are thinking that probably that's would be surprised if it happens. Do not look at that happening. But like I said, they've already made some progress with Jurassic World's evolution. And, uh, you know, the uh, the um, the Avery's in there, the aviaries. So I think uh, there might be something to that. That's kind of a little cheeky of them to put in a tweet. The birds are chirping. The air feels warm. So obviously looking right at this first picture, we are thinking South American DLC. I'm thinking jaguars, llamas, uh, maybe some different kind of bugs. You know, obviously they'll probably give us some more um, like uh, exhibit animals. But then on the turn side, on the flip side, though, a lot of people were saying they're hoping it's more than four animals. Um, because I guess, you know, a lot of people were saying they wanted the Arctic pack to pack a little more punch. So I don't know. The the conservative guess right now is that, that kind of like that consensus number that I'm hearing is seven animals. So I don't know. We'll just have to uh, kind of kick back, wait and see. So we know right now counting today they're on their third announcement tweet so i'm thinking especially now too I'm, i know i'm skipping a little ahead but we saw earlier like what it looks like to be a llama shadow like an alpaca kind of silhouette so uh, now they're even teasing what appears to be animals so hopefully we are getting pretty close to uh to some kind of reveal here um right now i'm recording this it's monday at 10 after 4 east coast time so i don't know if i'd really look to see because right now you know in the uk you're talking like what maybe it's 10 10 right now so i think we got our teaser for today that's it um but anyways moving on to march 28th it says going further you're amazed to discover an ancient temple you make your way inside and begin to travel through do you hashtag crawl through the crack in the wall or hashtag jump over the wall, uh, over the hole in the floor? So now our two little people are actually inside the temple. We definitely have some kind of weird little purple plant over in the doorway, which um, it kind of get, you know gets me kind of amped up because obviously they're going for, we're going to have some new uh, foliage options. So that's going to be really, really neat. Um, a lot of people were asking me kind of like what the little symbol is above the door um, back on Saturday when they posted this. Honestly, to me, it looks like some kind of beetle symbol. Um, so that's kind of what I'm rolling with on this. I'm thinking we're going to get some kind of, um, probably some kind of exhibit giant beetle type, uh, type, type um, exhibit creature, if you will. And then, of course, um, the next one, which was Sunday, so yesterday, exploring the temple further, you're blown away by the architecture inside. You run your fingers along the carved stone walls when suddenly, clunk, you've triggered a trap. Quick, you run hashtag forward or hashtag backwards. And then a lot of people were like, okay, what in the world is this? Um, why are there traps and motion traps? But here's another thing too that, um, that seems like it's been skipped over in all of this. Those people are not on any kind of path we have seen before. So what are they standing on here that allows them to be on those rocks is kind of what I'm saying. 
um, you know, like look at their little feet kind of standing above the little rock platforms. Like that's not a, um, any kind of path work. So what is letting them be up in the air and run from these spears and these little, these little things that are coming out of the walls at them? So I don't know, just kind of looking at that was a, was a little interesting. Um, but anyways, then um, we got a couple maintenance requests. They're like talking about the servers being down for, uh, for franchise mode maintenance. But then um, early, early this morning, about six hours ago, it says running as fast as you can. You have evaded the trap. Breathless, you come to a stop in a large room lit by a strange golden glow. A large statue towers over you. What could this be? And then, of course, in the background, in the shadow, what do you guys think that looks like? Definitely looks like a llama to me. So uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what kind of the deal is. Uh, Beyond Drew was kind of like, okay, this is getting really interesting, but also really kind of nerve wracking because we're so close to April Fools. Um, so you know, I don't know. It's just kind of yeah. It is it is a little weird. But um, hopefully by tomorrow, at least by Wednesday. Um, we will get to actually maybe see an animal or maybe have like a real formal announcement. Um, we don't know how long they're going to keep the teasing going. So um, anyways, guys, yeah, I just wanted to kind of jump in and get your thoughts on all this uh, on this tease fest that they have going on. And uh, what absolutely do you think could be coming our way? Like I said, I am definitely 100 percent team South America at this point. Um, it just makes sense with Easter and spring and all that coming up. And uh, I know kind of like it's kind of put a damper on the on the whole kind of situation. And it's uh, it might be tough for some of us to kind of get excited for this with kind of all that's going on. But maybe this like like a lot of people I've been seeing have said this could kind of be like our little escape. Uh, and, you know, it gives us a reason to be home. Um, and, you know, if you need a more reason to be home to not get other people sick or killed or get yourself sick. Uh, so yeah, maybe this will help everybody just give you one more reason, uh, to stay home and kind of list, uh, kind of help everybody ride this out if you will. So, uh, but anyways, guys, yeah, I'm S. Dan Wolf. Thank you for stopping by and hanging out with me. Don't forget to smash that like button if you're up enjoying this video. And, uh, yeah, I will catch you guys as soon as I know something, you'll know something. We'll get it out there and, uh, kind of find out what they have in store for us. So, uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. See ya.